Here's the best tips for if you're new to Gorilla Tag. First of all, let's start off with like cosmetics and city and stuff. So, there's a bunch of maps. So, first of all, there's city. So, you're gonna start off with 500 shiny rocks. But if you wanna buy shiny rocks, how you, what you do is you come to right here at the ATM. You click that, you click purchase, then you choose the one you want, then you can buy it. So, first of all, you're gonna start off with 500 shiny rocks. So, you might wanna buy the party hat, cause it's one of the cheapest. But, actually, people, might bully you in public lobbies and like scream at you calling you a minigames kid so don't buy this no 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 but what you can do if you're not going to buy any shiny rocks when you start off you can either save or you could try to buy this if you want to it's pretty good at least in my opinion and then there's a bunch of other cosmetics that cost um a thousand there's this that's a 500 it's a badge so there's this the top hat this one's really good. People might think you're pretty good at the game, so maybe save up for that or buy some shiny rocks to, um, so that way you can buy that. It's definitely worth it. So, then, if you want to buy a cosmetic, what you do is you click on it. Um, it'll say, do you want to buy this item? You say yes, and then it'll say, are you really sure? Then you say, yes, I need it. And so then, there's a bunch of maps. So, I'll, I'll do skills now. So, first of all, this is the, in my, at least in my opinion, the easiest skill in Gorilla Tag. It's called Double Walls. So you just go like this. You flap your arms like a bird once at a time and push yourself up at the same time. So then here's another skill with Double Walls. It's called Pinch Climbing. So you hug the wall like this, pull up and grab, pull up and grab. Then keep going like that till you get to the top. And then you can pinch climb. So then, there's branching. So you can go like this, like this. There's many ways of branching. Well, not really, but there's um, a ton of places that you can branch. Forest is the only place you can really branch. I mean, kind of in, um, what's it called? Kind of in clouds. Just a little bit, though. So, um, here's how to do the slide juke. I'm not that good at it. But I can kind of do it. Let's see. So you run towards it really fast. Put your arm like this. And there's no hitbox on your arm. So you go around. And then once you go like this, you put yourself up like that. Here's an example. Oh my god, I messed that up so bad. So I pretend there's a lava monkey chasing me. And you go like that to juke them. So here's how to underbranch. This is what underbranching is. So, what you do, so, there's a ton of places you can practice at. This one is probably my favorite. So, what you do, you, there's a couple ways. So, this is how I usually practice. You jump up, grab it like this, like if you were holding it still, like as it, like if your hands were bread and it was a sandwich, then you go around like this, and then shoot yourself out the other side, just like that. So, and then you can also go like this. You go up the tree, like this. And then you underbranch. So that's how you underbranch. This is how to wall climb. This is personally my favorite spot to wall climb. You just go back and forth. So usually um, you can have your arms like this, which makes it probably easier. And then you go like this, one at a time, like this. And I usually look up. And then if you've gotten the hang of it, you can start going fast. And so if you've gotten that all done and like you're good at it, Here's how to wall run. So, um, you can either, like, do the, like, Lucio motion where you go like this. Or you can go like this. So, I usually go like this. So, I usually use one arm. Like, I'll get myself started up with one arm. With both arms like this. And then, if needed, I'll just start using both arms again like this. So then, that's like one of the ways to wall climb. So you can, I mean, wall run. So you can go like this. It's not the most efficient way. Or you can kind of go like the Lucy O way. In my opinion, it's a lot better. So, um, let's see, is there any other, like, tips and tricks? Um, 
oh, how, here's how to funny run slash run really fast. So have your arms like this, and then go like this really fast on the ground. And then you'll go really fast. And then if you get tired of the music, just come up here, press that button. And then... Oh yeah, there's um, elevator climbing. So elevator climbing is put your arm through the wall like this and grab it on both sides, pull up, and kind of like pinch climb all the way up to the top. Yeah, so then here's a little juke I made up. Um, if you want to try, if you're going to try it and post it, tag me so that way I can see it. So what you do is you kind of like, you go really fast on the walls like this. And then what you do, you got to stay on the walls the whole time. You got to go like this. And then you turn around and pinch climb all the way up. Well, most of the way up. Then you go up double walls like that. Could be a really good juke. And then there's also um, routes. This is my favorite route. So you go up from double walls and you like this. And you don't miss that. And then there's this little guy, Doug. He has this little rainbow hair for this update. And then, I mean, that's really it. So, yeah. There's a bunch of tips and tricks for new players in Gorilla Tag. Like and subscribe.